Hi guys, this is Warm and welcome back to my channel. As you can see that I got a new hairstyle for myself which is body wave perm. I got a blog post about it so I will just link my blog down in the description box below if you guys want to see more detail about my hair. In this video, I'm going to share with you guys my October favorite because October is just ended and I think October passed by so fast, don't you guys think? Or maybe it's because I have been busy with my uni's life. As always, I'm going to start with beauty favorite first and then I will move on to my non-beauty favorite afterward. So the first thing which I have been loving is going to be this highlighter from MUA and it's called Undress That Your Skin Chimmer Highlighter. So it looks like this. I got this highlighter not a long time ago and I have been using this highlighter when I go out with my friends or having a party. I really like it. It gives me a very subtle glow to my face, not like too extreme and um, the shimmer of this highlighter is way um, fine. Um, it complements my skin very really nicely. It has um, kind of like a golden tone, not a warm tone like a pinkish because some of highlighter have a pinkish tone but this one has a golden tone which I think is complement um, my skin color really nicely. The next thing which I have been loving during last month is going to be this foundation from L'Oreal and it's a true match foundation and my color is in the 2W2 golden vanilla which looks like this after I came back to the UK I don't really go out into the sun that much so my skin is getting lighter and that's why I switch up to this foundation First of all, the color of this foundation matches my skin very really nicely and it gives me a very really natural finish which I really like it. This foundation is very really liquidy so it's super blendable and um, in terms of long lasting, I think it lasts me about like um, 4 to 5 hours. I don't recommend this foundation to people who have oily skin because this foundation have a shimmer in there. It's gonna make your um, skin look more oily. The next thing that I have been loving, I think it just launched in Thailand but here it's already have in UK for a long time already is a um, Maybelline Big Eyes Waterproof Mascara which looks like this. I think I have mentioned this um, mascara before in one of my favorite videos but anyway I have been using this mascara almost like literally every day. I really like how it's um, separate my eyelashes very well and makes my eye look bigger. In terms of volumizing my eyelashes, it doesn't volumize me that much but it elongate my lashes very well which is a good thing about this mascara. It's come in two parts which is the purple side is for the upper lashes and on the other side is for the lower lashes which is very nice. I really like um, the shade of the um, mascara wand as well. My last beauty favorite is going to be this eyelashes curler from Gino McCray and it looks like this. I bought this lash curler back in Thailand because I heard that this lash curler like the shape of the lash curler very really suitable for um, Thai eye shape. During this past month, I have been using this lash curler for like every day and I really like it because of the shape. I think it is true that um, it's very really suitable for Thai eye shape because like it can curl all of my um, outer part of my lashes very really well. I think this lash curler is very really worth it. I think as I remember the price is around like 270 baht something which is very really affordable. Alright so that's are all my beauty favorites and let's move on to my non-beauty favorites. 
I have been watching a series called Castle. It's a crime series, but the main focus is about a crime novelist. His name is Richard Castle, and he partnered up with um, detective, and she's name is Kate Beckett, and she's very hot. I really like how she dress up, and her makeup is very nice throughout the series. I still have two more seasons to go, so yeah, I think I will finish this series by this month. If you guys would like to check that series out, I will link the trailer down in the description box below as always. For the songs of this month, I have been loving Is You Down from Kid Ink. Yeah, I have been listening to um, hip hop songs and R&B songs quite a lot during last month. Also, I just knew in the last minute that um, Kid Ink also came to my unis but I didn't go because I have been um, working on my assignment and all design projects all the stuff so I didn't go and I'm really regretted anyway so that's it uh, for this video I hope you guys enjoy it and I know that I haven't been on like social network um, because of my life in unis is pretty hectic at the moment so i hope you guys don't forget me at some point anyways i will try to catch up with you guys and i will see you guys on my next video bye